I got a new tarot card in the mail yesterday. This one is Mermaid Tarot by Lisa uh, Robertson and illustrated by Julie Dillon. Yay! This one was actually released yesterday. And the publisher is Luella. Okay, I can't always say the names correctly. I'm sorry. Now, this has a magnetic close. And I've already done this video once. And then my iPad messed up. But here is the book. It is fully colored. They have big, beautiful pictures next to the meanings. And let's see. Oh, there it is. One thing I really like is it has the numbers. The meaning of the numbers at a quick glance. I like that. Something else that I noticed in the back, it has spells. So, I really like that. Nice and thick. Okay. There's the beautiful cards. Let me get them out. And there's the inside of the box. Beautiful box. Nice, heavy duty. But I normally put mine in bags. But not everybody does. So, all right. Let's look at these beautiful cards now. This is the full. Oh, okay. The full. Um, the back. Beautiful, calming. I love the back. It's like a little whirlpool of kelp with the sun in the center. The cards themselves, they're not the thinnest I've gotten. But they're not bad. I can live with it. I like how there's no border. I also like how nice and bright the colors are. So, the first one is the full. The magician. Magician. I can't talk right this morning. The high priestess. This is one of my favorite cards. I love the moon and her and all the stuff, See, all the little details are what makes these cards so special, I think. The Empress, and this is the goddess Yama, I can't say her name, I'm sorry. She's an African goddess, and that's one thing I also notice about this deck is that there are a lot of gods and goddesses in it, represented in it. And I like that. I like that a lot. <laughs> Look at the emperor. Neptune. It has to be Neptune. I haven't looked yet. The Hieroplant. The Lovers. The Chariot. Strength, the Hermit, Wheel of Fortune, Justice, the Hanged Man, Death. Now, in this card, the sailor is trying to help the bird. The mermaids are helping the turtle and the seal. It's like they're working as a team. I really like that. The blending of the different elements working together. Temperance. The devil. The tower. And like usual, the tower is not my favorite card. <laughs> but that's okay. It's necessary. This is another one of my favorites. The star, the moon, of course, another one of my favorites. <laughs> the sun, one thing I also like, they have a wide range of ages 
in this deck from children to old and that's how the world is judgment the both got mixed nationalities and I like that the world one of my favorite cards again I like too many okay now yeah, this is the suits this is the cups the ace of cups two of cups three of cups four of cups five of cups see the emotion on the face I love it it tells you the story six of cups seven of cups eight of cups nine of cups ten of cups the page of cups the knight of cups the queen of cups the king of cups look at that wand Ace of Wands. I love the coloring and how bright. And it looks like it's glowing. Love it. Two of Wands. I love the tattooing. Three of Wands. Oop. Four of Wands. Five of Wands. Six of Wands, Seven of Wands, I love this card, Eight of Wands, Baby, no, excuse her, Nine of Wands, One second, Baby, no, Okay, Ten of Wands. Sorry about that. Dog's going crazy. Wanting, can't decide if they want in or not. Page of Wands. Knight of Wands. Queen of Wands. Look at how powerful she looks. How strong and beautiful. Love it. Look at him. He looks like a king. Ace of Pentacles. Baby, no. Two of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles. And see if they brought in the fairies. I like that. Four, four of Pentacles. Now, I've also noticed that most of the Pentacles, which is an earth, is associated with the earth element. Um, a lot of them are above water. Not all of them, but most of them. Five of Pentacles. Baby. No. Six of Pentacles. Seven of Pentacles. Eight of Pentacles. I love this card. The deer. Air. The fox. The hawk. The frog. All of them. I'm going to get you with a spray bottle if you don't behave. I mean it. That kitty cat ain't hurting you. He's in his own yard even. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Nine of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles. Page of Pentacles. Nine Knight of Pentacles. The Queen of Pentacles. The King of Pentacles. The last Ace. Ace of Swords. 
two of swords. Oh, I'm sorry, there is a little cat that keeps coming and terrorizing my doggies. Three of swords. I'll leave you on four of swords. Be a good girl. Okay. Four of swords. Five of swords. Six of swords. Seven of swords. Eight of swords. Ah, it fell. Nine of swords. The ten of swords. The page of swords. The knight of swords. The queen of swords. One of my favorite of the queens. I love this one. She's just so beautiful and strong. And the king of swords. So that's all of them. Let's look at all the aces again. Oh, I didn't take one of them out. Oh, pinnacle. <laughs> da, da, da. There. The ace of pinnacles. All beautiful. I love it. I love all the aces. Aces tend to give me a good feel of the whole suit. Okay. Let's see. If I can get these up. Now. Okay. If you notice, all the pages is a mix of boys and girls. I like that. And it's not just with pages. Also with the knights. Okay, cards. Stand up. Males and females. I like that. I like the diversity in this deck. So again, this is the Mermaid Tarot. By Lisa Robson and illustrated by Julie Gillen. I hope you like this flip through. You might even get this deck. It's a beautiful deck. I'm looking forward to using it a lot. <laughs> Will you have a very good day and blessed be.